What's up, everybody? Took a bit of a drink, my bad, but uh, welcome back to Skull, the Hero Slayer. If you guys don't know what it is, it's a roguelite, roguelite, and uh, you know, we get to beat people up as this little skull guy. If you guys haven't seen any of my videos on this game, go ahead and uh, I mean, I think there should be a playlist somewhere. There, sh there should be a playlist, or this should already be in the playlist, so just go ahead and look for that. But, if you guys didn't know, last episode we did go ahead and add these traits. We did uh, level 2 of Marrow Transplant, and we also did level 4 of Fracture Prevention. We haven't made it really any farther, to be honest, but, you know, that that's going to change as we, like, get items and stuff. I thought I heard somebody say my name, my bad. So let's get our head again, and uh, obviously Skeleton Shield. We're going to go ahead and pick that guy up. And we're going to talk to our new guy, the Ogre Peddler. Don't touch my treasure. I usually don't... I usually know give away my treasures, but I give them to you. You good. So we automatically just get an item. So that makes a lot of sense. Um, I do like that. So we're going to have to already, so we, we can already kind of plan out where we want our uh, strategy. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like that a lot. That shield charge is nice. That shield charge was so nice. It felt good to use, man. That felt good to use. So we get this lady again. Maybe she can give us something. So I am free things to use skeleton. We try to confuse the enemy. All right. So we everything is the same. Um, dialogue that is. Oh, she gave me 25 bones that time. That's a lot of bones, man. So I kind of want to try to stay away from uh, ones I've already used. Obviously, besides the base one. The base one is obviously just... Can't switch off of that, but... I kind of want to stay away from the ones, the heads I've already used, just because, you know, I don't want you guys just to see the same thing. I want to get some variation. So we're actually just going to go ahead and stand in this, because I'm pretty sure that um, when this skill is cast, plans to flag Carleon in the current location. When near, when near the flag, increases physical and magical. So it would be nice to... Uh, just kind of stand next to these a little bit more whenever we find them. Don't know why we already took damage of that. To be honest with you. I'm really actually just confused. I rip. I don't know how long we keep this attack speed for, but it's probably worth to get. For right now. Nice. Let's go into another treasure room. I want to get as much uh, money as I can early. This does a lot of damage, actually. I kind of like that this is already a thing. Ooh! Hide in this little corner, go back. Nice. Now we're getting a lot better at not taking damage, which is always fucking awesome to do. We don't need that because that's health. <laughs> and uh, sorry if I don't talk too much in this video. I kind of just want to like make it a little bit further than last time. So I'm going to be sweating a little bit. Just a wee bit. Go ahead and just get rid of all these guys. Increases concentration by 40%, which I'm pretty sure concentration, I don't really know what that does. But uh, let's pick it up as, let's see. I think it's like reducing cooldowns of something. So, the rider. We will actually just go ahead and pick this up because I think the rider's pretty well. It's pretty good. Um... 
I kind of don't want an ultimate this early as well. We could always go with extra empire with the uh, attack and crit rate. But we also could do this one because it also gives us Monsieur. Yeah, let's go ahead and get this one and uh... You know what, let's get them both. Let's get them both, man. So hopefully this is a grounded target. It is. I've never fought this guy before, but just know it could be dangerous. This guy looks like he's very hard to deal with, to be honest. I kind of do want to get him in that, that corner, though. If I get him in a corner, we're looking good, actually. Because then we could just do that. Ride it away. Unstable quintessence. When you use a quintessence, the overload causes an explosion that deals physical damage and has a 50% chance to reset the cooldown. We will actually just go ahead and get the, the ultimate ability. Let's go ahead and see if we can upgrade this one. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Very nice. What is the up what what upgrades do we get? Oh, that makes us go farther. Anything new on this? Nope. Okay, let's see if we can actually upgrade this guy too. This is probably going to take 30. Yeah, and we didn't have 30 to begin with, so. Holy macaroni. If we wanted to speed run, that's how we would do it, man. That is exactly how we would do it right there. We just took 10 damage that we just got back. Awesome. Oh, you always like to see that. I don't really like the rider too much just because, um, I don't know. I do like it when it's like this, though. When it's like that, we are grooving. Like that, it, when, when we get like flat, no trap maps, like that's so, it's the, probably one of the best clears in the game, to be honest. Just give us health, increases attack speed, which we probably need, to be honest. What is that? Hold the phone. When you, when you use the quintessence draw on the power of the Lord of Hellfire and transform it to the Balrog for 20 seconds, we're going to turn into the Street Fighter fucking boxer, dude. I'm just kidding. Okay, I think we're just going to switch this out. Uh, I kind of just want this guy a little bit more. I just want I just want this guy a little bit more just because... Uh, <laughs> he's a little bit easier to control even though he's a little bit bigger. On the bigger side there. We should probably watch out. We did just heal and we're now at like... We're at lethal pretty much right now. We will actually take that. We do, we do want to do some pretty gnarly stuff with that.
Very nice. Very, very nice. <clears throat> We're doing a little bit better. We kind of want this guy to come in a little bit more. Nice, and we're doing big damage as usual. And now we're getting a lot more health back. A ninja over this guy, though? I mean, yeah. Sure. I mean, why, why wouldn't we? So let's go ahead and just keep the ninja out, as uh, I see the ninja being a lot more useful for Yggdrasil. Yggdrasil? Only because he can have three dashes. The three dashes kind of makes him, like, actually fucking insane. Because then you can just spam dash abilities. Like that, for example. I don't really, oh, I, I don't really have that much damage for this fight to be honest. So let's go ahead and switch over. That was a bad idea. We're doing this is doing a lot of damage to me. Oh my hello. Damn, that was our first time going down the Yager Cell in a while, huh? I mean, I don't know. I think it was just our uh, our skull picks. I mean, our skulls, because, I mean, the ninja's probably pretty good. I just don't like the uh, the big beefy guy for that, for Yinja still, just because you need to dash multiple times, to be honest. Let's go ahead and just not spend any points here. Get ahead. What does that do? Blocks the next incoming attack. We like that. You look poor. Take this. Decrease incoming damage. Oh, nice. All right, let's continue. I'm gonna to try to go as fast as I can, without taking with taking as little damage as possible here. All right, so we did all right. Ow. Continue. Kind of want to get rid of this uh, this head. Not my base one, but the uh, the other one. Although that did do a lot of damage. That did a shitload of damage, actually. Man, but if you get parries, it kind of frags, though, huh?
I mean, fuck, that kind of does a lot of damage, bro. You can't deny that that doesn't do a lot of damage. Should get rid of him really quick. And him. Kind of hurt my hurt myself there. I didn't mean to do that, to be honest. Another head, please. Nope, but we'll take the. Oh, we will take that. Increase attack speed to movement speed by thirty percent for three maps. Uh, we will actually just go ahead and uh, pick up the werewolf one. I do like that a little bit more. <laughs> we don't really want crit rate, I, I, at least not this time. I want to try going into. Uh, Volcano a little bit more. Oh, and we can get that. That's good. That's really, really good, boys. And we get this guy once again. He's kind of annoying the fight. Ow, that hurt a little bit. We gotta be really careful here. Just in case that it does extra damage. Hmm. I think we should go with uh, true damage here. I kind of my ah. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say my quintessence kind of sucks, man. We're doing really good though. That was our shortest time. We have no bones, unfortunately. So unlucky. That's actually awesome. I like that a lot more than my other one, yeah? Another head. Awesome. We can go ahead and pick that one up. We know what the gesture does from uh, last time. Alright, did not expect that to happen. Let's keep on keeping on. That just hit me for 10. That is fucking funny. Just heal my health. Increases basic attack damage by 30% until you clear two maps. It's pretty good. Just keep on going. Get some more money while we're out of here. We're taking a lot of damage there, but I think we can recover it a little bit. Whoa, 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 whoa. All 
Alright, let's keep on keeping on, boys. We do deal magic attacks, by the way. That's why I'm picking up magical items. I don't really know what all of them do yet, but I do just want to kind of just like slice through a lot of this, you know, stuff here. Whoa, hello. I really like this guy for big mob clearing. It's pretty nice. And another head. <clears throat> I mean... It's kind of hard not to pick this up, man. I'm going to go ahead and pick up Hellbike. And, um... Hopefully it doesn't cuck us when we're fighting Yggdrasil right now. I'm hoping that we'll have enough damage that it won't matter. 628 is our time. Wow. I don't think I want to use the motorcycle bike, but... We can go ahead and try. I'm gonna go ahead and actually instantly ult right here. If I can. This does do a lot of damage, surprisingly. This is getting a little bit crazy here. I, I do think we can defeat this though. And we do. <sighs> Alright, I mean... I mean, Yggdrasil is still... I mean, honestly... It's a tough boss, man. To be honest. Like, Yggdrasil is a tough boss. At least in my eyes he is. <laughs> So this guy could actually be really good for clearing this area. Now that I, uh, now that I'm looking at it. Oh yeah, baby. That is awesome. <laughs> so he was, he is good for clearing this fucking area. So we kind of want to be careful actually. We kind of want to wait for our uh, hot rod to come back. We're kind of just waiting. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. This is actually a really... Wow. I'm actually impressed. I didn't like the hot rod guy at first, but now it's kind of it's kind of growing on me a little bit here. We're gonna take the ghoul. I really, I love this guy, bro. This guy is awesome. This guy is awesome, man. Alright, go ahead into the shop really quick. Uh, we do actually need a lot of HP, so we will just go ahead and buy some of that. 
We won't buy anything else and we'll just uh, go on a merry way here. Very, very nice. He does a lot of damage too, which I kind of like, which I kind of like. This is getting a little bit tough. These guys are tough, man. Like, those guys are really, really tough. <coughs> when double jumping, it drops a bomb. I think we should honestly get that up. Would be pretty nice. And we get a fuse when swapping. Took free damage right there because I'm an idiot, so, you know, don't worry about that. Nice. And we get a Minotaurus again with the stomp. I actually don't want the Minotaurus this time, so we're gonna keep uh, we're gonna keep this guy around for a little bit longer. This should be a little bit harder. Oh my hello, did not mean to do that. <laughs> did actually not mean to do that. But we are making progress because we did get to that last boss on the second level. All right, so let's go ahead and do one more, and uh, you know that'll be the end of this episode. And then I'll uh, I'll probably stop playing the game for a little bit just because I've been playing it for you know quite a while now. Let's go ahead and get the we get the HP now, and uh, maybe reduce quint quintessence cooldown. That'll be very useful. Again, I mean we're gonna get this. This is what this does. It's pretty all right. Ooh, immediately increase our HP, and that's what we like to see here. <laughs> the deep woods. We're actually, we're getting pretty far. I don't know how big the game is or how long the game goes. But we're getting pretty far, man. I know I can hold the button down and do this, right, but... All right, so we got some some of our HP back that we wouldn't have before. Oh, forgot to kill that guy back there. I really do enjoy this game, though, man. And we just took free damage. Don't like to see that. Didn't mean to do that either. Keep on going. We'll take some damage. I'd rather take the damage early than late.
Keep on going. Come on, pink trees. What you got? So we're gonna just go ahead and try to speed run the Yggdrasil as fast as we can, as we should. Did you kill it? Of course. Of course he did. Why wouldn't he? Explosive ointment? Um. Let's get something else for a change. Something else for a change. Amplifies physical attack. Brawl, yes, we like that. Uh, increases physical attack. Yes, sir. We do like that, and it gives us extra courage. Let's just go ahead and get Rising Tide. I do realize that Rising Tide is a magical, but we will uh, end up spe we will end up switching here shortly. We probably don't have the best for uh, you know this. We do not have the best look for this here. Just for a stupid skeleton? Be calling stupid. I didn't realize that sitting underneath of her would actually just do damage. Awesome. I don't like this, by the way, so we might go with the hunter. Uh, we don't really want the slime, so we will actually just go with the hunter and uh, destroy this one. Just so we can have an extra physical attack here. Oh, 334 and 317. Let's go ahead and see if we can upgrade. 30 bones. See if we can upgrade. I don't think we're going to upgrade this one. We're probably going to get rid of him shortly. I don't really like him too much. Whoa, 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 whoa. I do like the hunter, oddly, a bit more than uh, a lot of other things. Give him a little hail of arrows that is going to completely miss. I just don't want to get rid of my my dude right now because he gives us a lot of like a lot of like AOE damage rather than the hunter giving no AOE damage. So But the hunter does give us a lot of range. Oh, come on now. I really got to pee now, so this is actually going to be the last one. That's going to hit me. This will be the last one for the video here. And the last one for quite a while, actually. At least it'll be a while for me. Because it'll be like four days before I upload. Or before I start playing again. But I do enjoy the game quite a bit. I enjoy the game quite a bit. So I might come back to it a lot sooner than that. The Hunter's really good. We'll go ahead and just get this for an HP barrier that depletes over time. Them doing damage to me is like killing them, which is awesome. Magic damage. Uh, we get better Empire, but we don't want magic damage right now. So let's go ahead and see if we can switch out. Oh, now we want magic damage. Fucking ass in a basket. 
Because this is our genie, man. Alright, we'll swap. We'll swap. We will go ahead and get a fucking quintessence because we won't be able to buy one later. Gold gain and increased health. Let's see, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Health is like very crucial. That hit up very hard. I should I should add that hit fucking very hard. It would probably be better for me just to, like, do those at the beginning, just so I could use it for the level, but... That is cheating! Why are they just dying on me? Let's figure out why they're dying on me. When hit create an explosion, that would make sense. Water skull. We don't want the water skull. I think the water skull is pretty trash. So now we go to Yggdrasil, which actually we have a lot, a lot of damage for Yggdrasil right now and a lot of maneuvering. So this is really good, actually. Took us a little bit longer because we had a little bit of a, you know, slower heads coming around this time, but. You know, we're doing all right. We can go ahead and get this guy good. Do you really want to try and wait to use everything now? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. We're doing good. <clears throat> nice. I mean, we're not doing too bad now. Cyclops, when you use the Quintessence, the Cyclops slams his fist and deals physical damage to nearby enemies, and you receive 20 shields. Pretty good. That's pretty good. 20 shield is, uh... Oh, it's a lot. It's a lot. So let's go ahead and see if we can upgrade one of these, actually. We have 22 bones. I kind of want to upgrade the archer and get rid of the other one. So it's going to cost 30 for both. Unfortunately for us. We will just go ahead and wait for our, uh, our abilities to come back up here. Ah, uh, that's going to do a lot of damage to us. Obviously, we're just going to wait for this one to come around. Oh no! Ah shit. 
I will just eat the damage, to be honest. No, I won't. Because if you get hit... Oh, man, I didn't realize that. We're taking a lot of damage here. This is a bad room. Bad RNG room here. Oh! Oh! Wow. So we're n probably not going to make it to the end, to be honest with you. Just wait a little bit. No, there's no reason to rush this. Just let them respawn. Come on now. I'm really trying not to die now. We're not going to be going into a challenge room this time. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hello. Uh-oh. That's bad. Whoa! That always gets catches me off guard every single time. We have really we have really bad heads for this boss fight too. 40% HP restore? Yes, please. We have really bad heads. I don't like this. Do not like this. Increases attack speed per kill. Uh not gonna be useful for us. Increases dash damage by 100%, decreases incoming damage by 10%. When you use Quintessence, the Succubus swings a scythe dealing damage. Alright, so we'll go ahead and destroy this. We'll swap heads as well. We don't really want the genie, we kind of want the hunt. Werewolf hunt. I could have re-rolled a little bit more. Uh... But I don't know. Whoa, hello. Whoa, whoa. Let's try to get as much health as we can here. Obviously, we're not going to be getting that much health. Those guys are a little bit harder to kill, man. So we're just going to go ahead and, uh... Ah! No! That's so unfortunate. We 
We're taking a lot of damage here. We were at 100, and now we're just dead. And now onto the boss fight when we're dead. Hopefully it gives us Leroy. Oh, this is really bad. This is going to be really bad. Oh. Oh, man. Getting to that, if I wouldn't have taken so much damage, we would have finished that boss fight. But we will be finishing the boss fight next video, no matter what. That boss fight next video, gone. Dunzo. You won't be seeing it. It's going to be uh, it's gonna be taken care of. We're going to take care of that shit. So we're going to actually just increase our damages here by a little bit. So I'm not going to remember what I upgraded, but hopefully you guys can remember. We made it... We're making it pretty far. We're making it consistently to the second uh, end boss here, which realistically, with it with my time played, is it's pretty fucking good. But I want to keep these videos below 50 minutes if possible. So thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed, please press the like button. And I hope you guys, I, I hope you guys like this, man. I really do, because uh, I want to keep uploading. So I'll see you guys in the later episodes. Bye bye.